Welcome to the Great Outdoors. We're here at uh, our new studio in Chancellor, Alabama, and it's on the property of Blue Sky Stables, which is uh, proudly owned by Miss Nancy Hayes, which is our co-star and, and the breath of Great Outdoors Productions. So I'm going to ask Nancy, uh, I've been wondering about this myself, how did, how did Blue Sky's Stables come about? Um, I think it was mostly because when there is a cloudy day, there's still blue skies on the other side of those clouds. So that was our words of wisdom. There's always a blue sky up there. You just have to wait for it to appear and just trust in God that it is on the other side of the clouds. So it became Blue Sky Stables. Okay, and uh, who, who lives here in Blue Sky Stables besides you? Besides me? <laughs> yeah. Okay, we have two dogs, Jackie, no, we have two dogs, Lucy, who is a black lab, and Peanut, who is a little chihuahua. I have two cats, and they are Gizmo and Lucky, and the barn actually is the old barn from Jackie and Jubilee, and they have now graduated to a new barn that's next door here. And so this is the old barn and it has been sitting here doing nothing and Al decided that it would make a beautiful studio. And he has converted it and it really is impressive. It was full of garbage and stuff a week ago and he has been working like crazy trying to get it all cleaned up and set up and as you can see it's usable. And I think it really looks cool again. It does. I, I'm, I'm proud of it. Um... I've uh, never had a, a real studio. We've had little tiny rooms that, you know, we could fit one person in and, and we put up a green screen and and you couldn't really do much. But we have it now. We have all the equipment that we need for a, a really good video shoot and, and a, a place where we can go and get out of the weather. And I want to thank you very much for that. This is this is a, another godsend that uh, Nancy has brought forth she's, ever since I met her. She's been fulfilling my my dreams and and so forth but uh, let's talk a little bit about uh, the show we went to on November 1st down at uh, Mitchell Nissan okay it was a cold oh, windy it was day it cold, yeah, it was windy and, uh, <laughs> yeah and Mitchell Nissan found a nice little corner around the back that was out of the wind and they had a uh, dog show the front of flying frisbee dog show and the dogs were fantastic. The show was terrific. If you missed it, you really missed a lot of fun. That was a good show. Yeah. The dogs are, um, I think they are based out of Kentucky. And the neat thing about it is that the show was to help support uh, the SOS Dog Shelter and the new um, uh, dog walk, what playground area that they're yeah. building over at uh, Henderson Park. And uh, most of the dogs that were in the dog show were rescued dogs. So that just shows what wonderful animals you can find at dog shelters and everybody needs to, and the SOS shelter had several dogs there and some darling puppies. And you all just need to go down to the SOS shelter, which is on Highway 84, just out, out of Enterprise towards um, Level Plains and have a look at their dogs. They have some wonderful, wonderful yeah. pets, dogs and cats that would love to find a home and they would just make someone very, very, very happy and you would make a pet extremely happy. They really would like to find a forever home and someone to love them. Mm, yeah. That's all they ask for. You can feed them the same thing every day, not like people, they're happy to get it and they they're always forgiving and they are make your mood sore and they make you feel good all over. You know, you know, I tried to make Lucy into a, a one of those flying frisbee dogs. Yeah, I saw the results of that. Yeah, uh, there's work. a chewed up frisbee in the backyard. Didn't work. No. She got me to chase it more than I got her to <laughs> chase it. So anyway, Lucy is uh, we're moving on to something else. Uh, I think she's gonna be a chew boxer. But, uh, you know, they, we have kickboxers and stuff. She's become a heck of a chewer. So, uh, well, that's, that's it. 
watch the video and you'll see exactly how much fun we had shooting it at Nissan, Mitchell Nissan in Enterprise, Alabama. Thank you, Nancy. Thank you, Al. <laughs> and always remember, you're always welcome at God's Great Outdoors. You have a blessed day. Hey. <laughs>
We left that fair in North Dakota, went all the way down to Nashville and performed our show at the Tennessee State Fair, which we've been there for two years in a row now. Um, so that's just some of the different things we've done up until this point. Um, starting probably next week or so, a college basketball season starts and we'll be traveling all over the country performing those basketball shows. So it's a lot of fun. Keeps us busy. You're touring the United States, huh? We see a lot. Yeah, <laughs> we saw more states in this week probably than a lot of my people might see in their lifetime just That's in a week. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah. And we have several little ones here who are anxious to see the show start. So thank you very much. Oh, thank you for having us. And we're lo looking forward to having fun with everyone. All right. Thank you. This is what you're doing all right. So far, so we're going to catch down with that. I'm just stressing the legs out about this microphone. All right. All right. We're going to get out here in the middle now. Slow things down. It's just going to make it just like this one. More fun, complicated tricks as we set it up for you one trick at a time. Here's most of the time to figure out how to pick those up. But you guys already know that we put on the grass pick and pop on the concrete right of the story. Now, this one here has done some pretty fun things over a short four years. One of which was just last summer. They invited us all the way to New York City. We performed for the Major League Baseball's Home Run Derby in New York Met Stadium. Myself, Gizmo, and these Frisbee were out in left field performing before 40. 3,000 people. Pretty fun stuff. This is part of the neat thing to get those out there and do it. Having fun with them. We're right now we're going to have a couple of you guys. Hopefully, get some more ready. All right, you guys. All right, so we're going to step over to these dog flips. We call it dog flips because it looks like a gymnast. Acrobatic move. It's just one frisbee. Head over heels, right? All right, let's keep it simple. All right. Hey, we're back again. I've got Stephanie here with SOS Animal Shelter. And um, Stephanie's going to give us some information on uh, one of the dogs that we interviewed last week and some of the other dogs that were from the shelter. Stephanie, who found homes this week? Uh, we had Tate, which was on last week's video. 
Um, she was adopted yesterday. We had Alex and Happy, which haven't been on any of the videos. They were a schnauzer and a Yorkie. They both found homes this morning. Um, Leroy is on hold, our little Dotson. Um, he's going home Sunday, I think. And then we got a cat named August to also get adopted this week. So it's been a good week for adoptions. That's great. Yeah. And you have some animals here at Mitchell Nissan. And I see you have a pen of three adorable puppies. Yes. And the dogs are all dressed up in their bandanas. And they're having fun. They're enjoying this cool weather. Yes, ma'am. They sure are. Um, the puppies are going to be here the rest of today. We're about to bring out some new dogs and take some of the other ones back to the shelter. So we'll have a whole new crowd out here in a little bit. So, right. yeah. Okay. And it's a cool day, one of our first cool days of fall this year, but they have set this little arena up for the show. Did you see the puppies? Oh, they're just... Let's see. There's your lens going now. The lens cleaner. <laughs> Back when I first got the dog, I named her Piper because she barked so much. So I didn't really like the name, so I changed it to Penny. So we got Penny, and we thought, we like the name Piper. So Piper's now Piper again. And she's been Piper for just a whole other year. She's a really young dog. Thank you all for encouraging Piper, letting her come out and have some fun. Hopefully we'll have a whole bunch of more exciting tricks in our trick bag before too long. But Piper, I think you did a really good job for only a year old and just coming out and meeting all these people and doing that for the first time. Good girl. All right, good job, Missy. All right. Yo, man. Get you right down here. All right, get a whole bunch of little dancing time. I'm going to show you guys what the viewers dance with what he does. So we can do some cool stuff for us. Come on, it's back to the Hey, sit up there. All right. Hey, we're going to do a backward circle here. How about that? Yeah. Nice, nice. I like it. I like it. All right. Good. 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 All right. Uh, we'll try that one again. What do you think? One more time? Alright. This is what I think I'm going to do though, man. That was a lot of fun. Let's try it again. One, two, three. Alright. Alright. There's one. Alright. The other way. Oh. How about the go? How about the go? Oh. oh, 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 oh. This one's up to actually jump as high as he would. Jeff over here on the other hand, still on the little low from where I'm on a big air jump. We're both trying to have a good time with this hole right now. We're going to try to get him to do his last trick here. Alright. We're trying to go in the air off my back. That is his favorite thing to do. We're going to try to get him geared up right in the middle, flying high across the field here, okay? You guys help me out here, okay? Once you see this one make a catch, he's going to be running back to me. You all cheer up a little noise when you see that happen. And hopefully I get this song to fly real high for us on my back. So let's try it. Here we go. Whoa. Hey, good save. Come here. Come here, guys. Yeah. All right. Great job, Gizmo. All right, thanks for sharing along. And right now, Gizmo's going to go in for a little water break. Good job, young man. All right. Hi, I'm here with Kathy Setberry. She is the marketing director for Mitchell Nissan. And she is the one who has made all the arrangements for this Come Catch the Fun Trick Dog Show that we have today at Mitchell Nissan. So Kathy, tell us something about what all you do here to uh, help with marketing at Mitchell Nissan. Well, on events like this, um, the whole purpose of it is to give back to our community. Um, you know, it's just awesome to be able to support a group that, that's in such need like SOS, Save Our Strays. Um, people don't really realize it, but they're a no-kill shelter. And anything that we can do to help SOS is the main reason why we put this on today. Excellent. And they are such a good organization. The people who work there are just great to work with. Yes, I've had the privilege to meet several of them, and I think they're awesome. And it's just 
it's been a great day too. I mean, we've had a lot of people come out. We've had a lot of food donated, um, some monetary donations, and we're just thankful that there are people right here in our community that care also. Thank you. And Mitchell Nissan here is hosting the program today. So how about telling us something about Mitchell Nissan? We're at their new facility, and I uh, hear you're getting ready to open up. Yes, um, hopefully we'll be in our building in a couple of weeks, if not next week, and uh, plan to have a grand opening on January 15th. We'd like to invite everyone out to come see our new facility and meet all our great people here that also are involved in all the community as well. So keep your eyes and ears open and find out what Mitchell Nissan and all the other people in this community have to offer because there's plenty of things going on and we hope that you'll come out and enjoy with us as we have today. And remember, you're always welcome in God's great outdoors. And have a blessed day.
to be. I gotta let the slime hounds dog show. That's really neat. They throw it and catch it. It looks like a lot of fun, so I thought I'd try it. A frisbee, huh? You have fun when you tap them like that. Uh, I'm not very good at it. I gotta go sniff out a tree or something. So, look, be careful with that kid, okay? <laughs> 